Hi Stampers, thanks for joining me today. I wanna to wish you a very happy new year. And if you're like myself, I've already put all my Christmas things away. I've kind of organized, I've purged some of my stamps. So I'm ready for new products and new creativity. And I hope to take you along with me. So I'm gonna show you these two new catalogs today, but before I do, I just wanted to go through a little bit of housekeeping. Um, I have my host code, which this is good till about January 8th, and then I'll be changing it. So if you're ordering today after this video, um, our new catalogs are live today. If you're inspired to go ahead and order, please use this host code and I'll send you out a thank you. We also have a new kit that is going to be released tomorrow. And this one is a birthday one. Let's see, it's Light the Candles. And it is a card kit and it has two different, let me hold that up closer, two different, um, one is like a cake and one's a bunch of candles, has everything in the kit that you need. Now these are not in our catalogs. Remember these are just online. So when you go to stampfanatics.com and you click shop, you'll go to kits and this is the brand new one that they're gonna be releasing tomorrow. Okay, we also have um, a new thing that's going to be starting in February, I wanted to give you a heads up now, and it's called All Together. And what they do is they have blends that are all the different skin tones. So we've been sort of limited lately in what we had for skin tones for people to use. And so um, we definitely wanted to add some more. So they have that. They have um, wonderful designer paper. They have um, two stamp uh, stamp sets that go along with it. And I'll have more information on this on my blog. I just wanted to give you a heads up. And if you don't wanna wait till February, you can join my team today and you could order this early because we're gonna be able to pre-order this early. Okay, and then during our celebration time, which is through February 28th, you can get two free stamp sets when you join my team. So I just wanted to tell you, it's any um, stamp set out of the catalog, I believe even out of the clearance rack or anything, but just not out of um, the celebration catalog. Let's see, um, you can order out of the mini um, and just not the host sets. So it's just limited to no hosts and no celebration because these you have to earn. But everything else, anything you see in these catalogs, you can make your little list. And if you know you're spending $100, I mean, our starter kit is only 99, and it's anything that you'd like to put in it. So you can pick from your orders and go ahead and join, and I have a join button on stampfanatics.com. So you can just click that, be part of our team, you get part of a, a huge team that I'm under, and then plus um, you have access to a lot of Stampin' Ups demonstrator sites and things for more creativity, more friendships, the friendships I've made during um, being a demonstrator, which I never thought I was going to be. I was just doing it for the hobby and for the discount. And that's up to you. You can do it either way. You can do it just as a hobby for yourself and enjoy all the discounts, or you can become a demonstrator like me. And um, I mean, not just a demonstrator, but um, you can do it as a business if you'd like and take it as far as you want to go. And I'll be happy to help you either way. Most of my team are hobbyists. Most of Stampin' Up's people are just hobbyists. So don't think that you have to then become a business. So um, it's nice if you do, but you don't have to. Okay. So we're gonna start with um, our mini spring catalog. This goes January through June of 22. And they have all lots of new products. There's a little table of contents here. Let's try to get some of this glare away. Um, but um, so you can see if you want product suites, you have go here. If you wanna host or join, you can go there. And there's indexes in the back that kind of categorize by bundles or by um, catalog at a glance, which is you alphabetize your stamp sets, you know, your um, accessories and things like that. So, okay, let's get into our first set. Oh, and then they also have about Paper Pumpkin, which is a monthly subscription that you control if you'd like to join that. And here is our first suite, and this is called Sweet Talk. I don't know how to get this out without making it look too dark, but I'm going to try. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, Sweet Talk is a great conversational 
um, set. It has this beautiful paper, which I do have. Now, let me get some of my things out of the way. And I'll bring that in. And this I've already kind of cut into, but it has like beautiful hearts in reds, pinks, and purples. And then you have this on the back, so you have two-sided paper. You've got all the conversation hearts. And the good thing about this is there's a stamp set and dies, which is a bundle, um, that you can lay on here and cut out some of the hearts. You've got um, I love you in different languages on the back. Let's see. We've also got this, which is, again, the pinks and the reds. And then on the back, we have this beautiful red and white polka dot. And we have the candy. We've got just a nice kind of ombre effect paper on the back. Red and pink hearts again. Nice striped paper. All the pinks, purples, reds, hearts again. Nice purple striped paper. And these would coordinate well if you're making a bag or a box. And then again, the conversation hearts with the little ones that I've already used. And what I've done is I have made a cute little uh, conversational box, which if you look here on page nine, you have what they call sweet talk boxes. And those are, let's see, right here. And you get, let's see, how many do you get? You get 10 of them and they are, $10, so they're a dollar a piece. Not too bad, they're already pre-scored for you. They already have the tear and tape. So all you have to do is assemble it and put it together. And if you hold on to the end of the video, or the end of this Facebook, I will make this for you and show you how I put this whole thing together. Okay, um, there's also some beautiful ribbon. There are iridescent rhinestones. And those, uh, let's see, rhinestones, that's basic jewel, here we go. These are the iridescent rhinestones, and I don't know if you can see the iridescent, but they are beautiful, and they come in a smaller size and a larger size. Uh, 200 adhesive back gems, you can't beat that, and they're 750. So that is something else to consider. Um, let me think if there's anything else. The red ribbon we've had, uh, it's a linen ribbon. It's pretty. And then here, like I said, is your sweet conversations. Now here's the stamp set. Has all these great sayings. And then it's, it's just really cute. Like you are cute. Text me, BFF, hug me. And in my little treat box, because I want to give it to friends, I just use, no, not in this. I'm sorry. It's in a card. And let me see if I have that card out. Uh, okay, this is, I was going to show you later, but I'll show you now. I just put text me and BFF because I use this saying, finding a friend is the best discovery of all. And so you can use these versatile for, you know, different cards and things, not just for Valentine's. All right, so um, also comes with all of these great dies that cut out. And like I said, they match up to some of the paper too. And this paper, let's see if I can get this out. You can earn for free, I believe it's in, no, I'm sorry, that is right here in the book, in the catalog, right here. This is the paper here, and it's called Sweet Talk. And like I said, it has all those beautiful colors, real red, petal pink, so saffron, granny apple green, pool party, and highland heather. Okay, now, this is a set that I decided to get this year. And it has, it's called Love and Happiness. It has all these great sayings for anniversary, for wedding, to the one I love, for my husband, um, anniversary. Let's see what else. Valentine's Day, friend. And um, to my wife. There's just a lot of great sayings in this one. And then if you notice, all of the shapes are in the dies. I don't think I have the dies out. No, I don't. Okay. Um, I might have put them away already. Let me just see if I have them handy. No, I don't. Okay. Um, I'll show you them in another video, but it also comes with this great stamp and cut emboss bouquet of love folder. And if you can see, it has an inlaid heart that the dies fit perfectly in. 
this heart, so you can cut out the center heart. And if you look at some of the samples in the book, you'll see. Now here's what I did was I just kind of copied that sample and showed you how beautiful it is. See how it cuts the heart in the middle after you've embossed, and this is the embossing. And then I took my blend markers and I colored some of the flowers. I stamped the wedding wishes, because this will be a wedding card. And this outside heart was done with that die that comes in the set. So there's an idea for you. And oh, I wish I had my, my dies. I'll have to look for them. I've been so crazy busy trying to get this ready for you guys. I don't know where I put them, but um, yeah, they're not in here anymore because I probably put them on, let me see, real quick. No, I'm not seeing them, so I don't know where I put them, but I will look for them and show you them at another video. Okay, so that is this whole uh, bundle. Um, so you're really getting a lot. You're getting the whole stamp set, you're getting all the dies, and you're getting the embossing folder. Okay. The next one we have is the Gumball Greeting Bundle. And we had something similar than this a couple years ago, but I love how they change up the sweets and the stamp sets to have different sayings. Wishing you the sweetest day ever. May your day be filled with all the best things. I choose you. How cute. And then they have, of course, some um, little embellishments that you can put in and you can make it, um, let's see, Gumball Machine Shaker Dome. You can make it a shaker card. Okay, and then I had this one, which I did get too, called Nuts and Bolts, and it is so adorable. I don't think it's just for kids, because it says, you make my heart go beep. I mean, how cute is that? My husband's getting that one. <laughs> uh, greetings, kind human. I'm nuts and bolts about you. Happy birthday to you. And this could be a flower made out of bolts. And that's where I got this for the cute little box that I'm going to do. And I said, you make my heart go beep. So that'll be something coming up. Um, trying to think. Yep, that's it for that one. Okay. Then this is Flowering Fields. Now I have a friend who's from Amsterdam that she does have a huge um, greenhouse in North Carolina. And I just love her flowers. So this is a beautiful set. It comes with this gorgeous flowering um, designer series paper. There are these great butterflies, and these are so cool because they're brushed brass, but look, they're flat. So they'll go through the mail a lot easier than the, you know, puffed up ones. So I did get those. And then you have this beautiful um, window pane ribbon. You have the stamp set and dies. There's two stamp sets, flowering tulips, and um, let's see, what's the other one? Tulip fields. Okay, so that's that one and that one. So here's the flowering tulips, and they have dies that you can build actually dimensional tulips, just like it shows in the book. And then you also have tulip field bundle. Again, this has the windmill that you can, with a brad, you know, use it and make it like a windmill. So nice. Okay, and then rainbow of happiness bundle. Now, I bought this before I even saw it, but I have to tell you that on Christmas Eve, we had a double rainbow. And I just thought, wow, this is Christmas Eve. Does this mean Christmas is going to be great? Next year is going to be great? And it just seems so hopeful. So I do have that one. And that is the Rainbow of Happiness. Here's a little card that I did. And I just think it's cheery. Sending you a rainbow of happiness. And I did put the little butterflies on there. And I used some of the designer series paper and a little something to brighten your day. And this is just a generic card that you can use for a birthday or just hi, I'm saying, you know, hello to you or whatever. And here are the things and see how this fits right in the rainbow. It, it's just a great set. They also have dies that you can cut out. Um, I did not get the dies, but, and they also have um, a punch that cuts clouds. So you can make, you know, a rainbow with the clouds. Uh, Friends of the Forest, this is another set that was in there, and it goes with the reindeer punch. So if you got that at Christmas, um, you can use it with this reindeer too. I mean this deer. <laughs> okay, then we said, hello, Ladybug. Now we have the Ladybug stamp set, I don't know, a few years back, but this one, I wasn't going to get it at first. And then I said, you know what, it's got the daisy, which happens to fit your daisy punch. 
um, I believe it's the medium size daisy, is the same. So if you have that daisy punch, it goes along. It might not cut it exactly, but it cuts within it, so it's perfect. I mean, it has a smidge that doesn't cut out, and you could even use that layer on a card as a um, kind of a negative space. But this is adorable because you can go ahead and build your butterflies like they did here. And here's some cards that kind of show you cute ideas. And then we have Wildflower Path. Lots of beautiful wildflowers. Do not go where the path may lead. Go instead where there's no path and leave a trail. And it's by Ralph Waldo Emerson. This would be perfect for graduation card. Um, just love how the sayings are. And again, the pretty paper. Symbols of Fortune. Now this one we don't have available at this moment, but it should be coming in. Um, I think it was delayed in shipping. You know how our shipping's been going. So as soon as it comes in, I'll let you know. Um, and this ribbon, I think we can't get it. It's soft succulent. But um, I believe the paper's all in and everything else. So if it's on your wish list, leave it there. I'll let you know when it comes in. And that's the stamp set for it. Um, Paradise Palms, again, nice things if you live in the South or Hawaii or somewhere where, you know, you know people or you live there and you can go ahead and make these beautiful scenes. We've got Boughs and Blossoms and this um, is beautiful flowers. Hello, thank you. It's been too long. You've also got Easter Friends. He's so adorable. I didn't get him yet, but I will get him, you know, more like in the springtime. And again, there's the um, nice boots with the watering can and you know some flowers and things called Flowering Rain Boots Bundle. Has dyes that will cut out for you. You've got Kite Delight. So in the spring, another good one for flying kites. Another year flies by, happy birthday. Your friendship is so uplifting. And then we have our next suite is Art Artfully Composed. And this one um, has artfully layered, is a stamp set with the dies to match. So when you have a bundle like that, you can save 10% buying them at the same time. Um, they also have this great sea glass. Look at that. Um, these little pebbles that you can add to your boxes or your cards. Just add in the colors in here, Calypso Coral, uh, Pale Papaya, Pear Pizzazz, Evening Evergreen, Just Jade, and Mint Macaron. I mean, beautiful, light pastel colors. There's a nice vellum in there. They also have um, a frayed ribbon. <clears throat> and then here's what the stamp set looks like. And over here, you've got um, Dahlia Days, and you have the Dahlia Flowers and some nice sayings. And you also can get it as a bundle. When you see this 10% down here, <clears throat> excuse me, it tells you that you can get it as a bundle and save. Okay, uh, flowering flowers. Again, a really pretty one, just a note. Nice flowers, um, time for a happy dance, sending a card instead of a text. Great one. <laughs> and then over here is your daffodil daydream bundle. And we do have some daffodil paper I'm going to show you that you can earn for free in celebration to go along with this. This bundle is $54, so you would qualify for the paper free. So anything that's $50 usually will get you the free item in the celebration book. There is usually one item or so that might be $100. Okay, we've got Seize the Day, more great underwater things um, if you live near the ocean or you know people and here's some more scene building that you can do called oceanfront i mean look how beautiful that is and let's see there's another one in here called amazing silhouette bundle and it also has um dies that cut out the sayings so you've got these dimensional dies which are great uh eden's garden and then New Horizon is another new gorgeous ocean type themed um, that has even a little fence die. I think you saw that, let's see, in this picture here. See that little, and it looks like a path leading to the ocean. And you have the seagrass and you have all the different. And then this paper has a lot of scene, scenery on it. Like this is all the paper. And then all they did was put a saying on it and then the little fences. So you don't have to do much to dress up this paper. It's sort of done for you. It's sort of a horizon look. Um, it could be a water look. It could be the ocean. I mean, 
it's beautiful. And then you have this combination cotton ribbon pack. I do have that, um, and I already labeled it. I have Petal Pink and Misty Moonlight. And they're about, I don't know if it's a quarter inch. Let's see, what does it say? Um, 4.5 mil, let's see. That doesn't tell me what it is though. Oh here, one eighth of an inch. So it's an eighth of an inch ribbon. It ties a bow really great. Um, it's a cotton, so it ties real easy. And it's just the perfect size to me to make for little projects or cards. Okay. checking my computer here. Okay, um, let's see, what else can I show you? Oh, and here they have pebbles enamel shapes. And again, like the sea glass, these are pebbles and they just look so beautiful. Let's see, here they used it on this card in the book, you can see, and they just lined the fence with little pebbles from like the beach, <laughs> and it's so cute. Now, I actually got a cactus set that I'm gonna use the pebbles for. Um, this one is Eclectic Garden. It's so cute. It's got the bird. It's got, um, I don't know, that kind of looks like an artichoke to me. I think it is. <laughs> Sending bright wishes for a happy day. Thanks so much. Just don't know what I'd do without you. Got some radishes and some great background. Here are your background stamps. You have Timeless Tiles and Gentle Waves. The waves would go great on that beach um, scenes that we have. You got Soaring Swallows. So here's the birds, and it comes with the die, so you can cut it all out. And over here, we've got Grassy Grove, and this is a bundle too, which gives you this whole scene is one of the dies that just cuts out, you layer it on top of your card. Um, it's got trees, and here's some of the trees. And then you can punch those clouds out if you want, or they have the clouds in the dies. And then Abstract Beauty. This one is very colorful. Um, we've seen similar paper to this because it has the goldish in it and just all the pretty colors. Um, let's see, Magenta Madness, Blushing Bride, pump, Pumpkin Pie, Crushed Curry, Just Jade, and Knight of Navy. So great colors. And here's the stamp set. And you can see it's got some abstract kind of geometrics. And then the dies are really, really cool. Uh, let's see. Then this one is happy and heartfelt. Beautiful sayings. Um, let's see. We have to celebrate this. Yay for love. Lucky me. Hello, baby. Thank you. You matter to me. I mean, great sayings. Okay. Then we have slimline cards finally. Yay. <laughs> so far, I've bought the envelopes. And they are, let's see. You get white. You get a gray, sort of looks like gray granite maybe, or smoky, smoky slate, I'm not sure. And then a green, which is sort of like a green macaron, or maybe it's soft succulent, I'm not sure. But you get a green, you wind up getting um, 15 of these, so you get five of each size. So you finally have envelopes to make these cards. Now they also come with some dies, as you see here. And so you can get it as a bundle. You have these giant sayings you can put on your card, and then these dies make these designs and then you have your envelopes too this is a cute one best delivery i've seen a couple of people do things with this it's adorable um that could be good for like valentine's day or an anniversary and let's see birthday wishes we've got Ranoculus Romance Bundle. There's a <laughs> mouthful. Anyway, they have the beautiful flowers, the Ranoculus flowers, and then they have dyes that you can almost make like a doily out of. And let's see, the next one is Bragworthy. And this is just one minute you're young and cool, and the next you're getting excited over new towels. Happy birthday. Uh, your friendship is as bragworthy as a dress with pockets. <laughs> I mean, it's a cute saying, something to make people smile. Okay, this one is sentimental swirls, beautiful swirls and flowers, and a little cute bird. And thank you, hello, happy birthday. And here's some great ideas. Always look at your catalog for some of the ideas for cards and things. It's done and right there for you. Uh, in the moment, this is a popular one too. Uh, you're always good to others, so be good to yourself, too. Sometimes the most productive things you can do is relax. 
and you're in my thoughts. And here's some great card ideas. There will be a ton of them online because people have already started making them. Um, I did want to say, and I didn't mention it yet, um, on the Ladybug one, if you're thinking of getting it, I would go ahead and order it in January because I have a feeling by February it's going to be back ordered. It's very, very popular. Um, Sweet Heart and Home. This one has two stamp sets, a uh, Blessings of Home Bundle and Honey Bee Home Bundle. It's got some beautiful denim ribbon, some embossing folders, Honey Bee, um, what is this one? Let's see, number three. It's a Hive 3D embossing folder. You have some dots, some uh, doilies, and then some card kits and some beautiful designer paper. And the next one is Blessings of Home Bundle. And this one, Again, great big flowers, so you don't have to do much to make the card. And then beautiful sayings that you can put on it. Another one, Honey Bee Home Bundle, is, um, has the bees. Best of luck. Um, so glad we're family. And then, again, some more flowers. And then we've got more love. This one, enjoy every chapter of our friendship. And that's really cool. Um, the world needs more of, let's see, the world needs more love notes. How cute is that? Okay, then we've got Catch You Later. I had to get it. It's so cute. Look at this guy. Um, I'll catch you later, dear friend. <laughs> and this one, I love hanging around with you. Quail. We have quail here out in the desert, and they're on our little park when we do our walk every day, so we get to hear them squabble and kind of run around. They're almost like a road runner. They are so adorable. So I had to get those. Um, better together. I'll always be here for you. I'll catch you later, dear friend. Just a really cute set. And there's some ideas for um, cards and things in there. Okay, we have the hedgehog back again, only this time he's different. He has got so many cute things with him. The two hedgehogs. You have this cute little mushroom, butterfly, or adorable bird, this beautiful plant, and then it says, it's nice of you to be so nice. Finding a friend is the best discovery of all. So I took one of our note cards, and I stamped a little bird on the envelope, and I made this cute little card. I used some of our designer paper, text me, and BFF, I cut out of that other paper I showed you, the conversation paper. Um, and then I stamped the little bird inside too, but that's just one. And then I put the hedgehog in the butterfly because I wanted him to be his friend. So I just used that. Then I decided, well, okay, without the hedgehog, look at this one. Yeah, I used the cute little uh, mushroom, the bird and the butterfly. It's so nice of you to be nice. I thought it would make a nice thank you card. And then this is from the Iconic Dyes, which are in our annual catalog. They're already in there. You can already get them. And I just colored it <coughs> and popped it up to make it dimensional right next to that. I knew once I saw this, this set, I was going to get those dyes. So um, that's another set and some ideas for you. And then there's ideas here in, in the book, too. And it also has a punch. So that is part of a bundle if you want to get them together and save 10%. Um, celebrating you, you've got all these great celebrations, Father's Day, um, Happy Mother's Day, Welcome Little One. When you need sayings for your cards, sometimes it's great to just add another one to your collection. And then I got this Cactus Cuties because I just thought it was cute and I am living in the desert right now and you know, Nevada. So I thought, okay, I'm going to get it. My son absolutely loves cactus. So um, hope your day is on point. Just a note and hello. And I love when they have the just a note because I like to just send out notes now and then to my friends. And this is a clear poly. So you can see where you're stamping. And it comes with a punch. So you can make it as a bundle. And, and I didn't even show you um, when I showed you the ladybug about the punch, but they do have a punch too. So those you can kind of see from the catalog. Uh, Lucky You. <clears throat> this is um, a simple or step it up. Okay, so there it's simple. There it's a little bit and there's a little bit more and there's a cloud again. So you can use these sets and they already have that kind of swoosh behind them. So that makes it really different. 
Hello, sports fan. Here you go. If you have kids or you know people that are sports fans, your, your husband, your wife, whoever, this is a great set. It's got all the different, like, um, Grand Slam, your amazing Happy Father's Day, Happy Birthday, wonderful paper, little tickets and things. And then it's got the dies that match, like, the banner or the ticket or the different parts. Um, it also comes with a twine bundle. Let's see. The Baker's Twine is Evening Evergreen, Night of Navy, and Poppy Parade. Okay. And then let's, and then it has, well, I showed you the paper and the stars. And this one is to add to those sailboat fans. We've got Let's Set Sail. Now this time they have a punch that helps you build the sailboat, which is so cool. And then all these other scenes you can get from other stamp sets, or you can use from here, some of the water and the sayings. This one is nice, Wildlife Wonder, for people that really love the wildlife. You've got a bear, you've got an owl. I think this is a wolf. And then these great little side things that you can do like they did here. And they even added a tree. <clears throat> And here's the um, little trees here from other stamp sets. So you can coordinate them. And then uh, you mean so much to me, a uh, note of thanks, sending birthday wishes to a great guy. Very cute. And then here's for your handyman or handy woman. <laughs> We've got home and garden bundle. You've got the stamp set. You've got a um, dies that will cut out your ladders, your rakes and all the different things. And let's see, you can buy it as a bundle and save 10%. For your Viking fans, we've got the boat or whatever ship, I'm not sure. <laughs> and then the girl and the guy, very cute. If you have any Nordic friends, <clears throat> even cuter. I mean, it's like, yeah, I've taken a Viking to you. Cute for even Valentine's Day or something or an anniversary. For the record, you're my favorite song. You're awesome. I really like you and happy birthday. And you've got the record and all the cute little, like, um, you could put this down the side of a card, stamp it. Awesome. Okay, then Encore. They brought back the squirrel. So Nuts About You is back. Brushed uh, metallic adhesive back dots. All the different things that have come back and returned from the previous catalog are listed here on page 75. Then you have Bundle and Save. And so if you forget which ones have bundles, just come back here. And you can look them up real quick. They're alphabetized. I think they're alphabetized. No? Yeah, they're alphabetized. And and look, you don't always have to make a lady a ladybug red. It can be pink, it could be other colors. Love it. There's your rainbow one I liked. Just tons of them. And then catalog at a glance just gives you all the stamp sets alphabetized, all the dies. Go over here, you have all your punches, all your embossing folders. They've labeled every category, paper, um, embellishments, and everything that you need. And then the joining special, and that I told you about in the beginning of this Facebook, is during the celebration time, which is up till February 28th, if you join or you know that you have a wish list that is about $100 for $99, you can buy 125 and only pay 99 plus tax. Shipping is free, so you're saving on the shipping. Highly recommend this. And you get to pick out two free stamp sets of your choice. So you build your starter kit any way you want to become a demonstrator, and all you have to do is go to stampfanatics.com and hit join. Join the fun. And then I don't want to forget to tell you about this again. I've said it on another video, but <clears throat> these are your rewards. When you purchase 150 or more, you get 10% of whatever you purchase. So this would be $15. And you can purchase anything in the books that you want for free up to $15. Um, 300 gets you 12%, 450 gets you 14, and a 50% off item. So if you have something big you want, that's the time when your order is big to get a half price item. 600 or more, you get 16%, you still get that half price item. Now, besides that, I wanted to show you, they always have a couple stamp sets that are just for hosts, okay? Host doesn't mean you have to throw a party anymore. It doesn't mean that at all. It just means your order is $150. 
Now, either you have a big list and you can do it yourself or grab a friend and say, hey, order with me and we can go ahead and um, I'll put it in and then you can have your choice of these host sets. Mischievous Mice, which is my favorite. I've already got them. Look at that. He's so cute. Anyway, I say cheese and then I didn't write anything inside because I'm not sure. I guess it'll be your birthday. But cute little mice there and there. And it says, um, just a quick note to say, hi, sweet friend. Thanks. Say cheese. It's your birthday. Just really cute things. I'll probably put it's your birthday inside that one. The second one is expression of friendship. Thinking of you. Thank you. Girl on a swing. I mean, just a very whimsical set. Lots of sayings in it. And these you can earn for free. This one would be $13.50 and this one would be $12.50, which is a $21 value, but you can't buy them. There's no way that you're buying them. Um, if you're a demonstrator, you could always try to get them. Um, uh -oh, wait a minute. Just want to make sure I'm not frozen. Nope, I'm good. Okay, hi, Joan. Thanks for joining me. I see it now. Um, I've just been kind of whizzing through this because I want to get through everything. So don't forget that you can be eligible for these if your order is that big. Like I said, I don't know why they keep calling it host rewards or whatever because you don't have to host a party anymore. It's just if your order is 150 or more. All right, so that's our mini catalog. Yay! Now, let me show you our celebration these are items again that you can earn for free okay so the first one we have is island vibes so with a 50 dollars order you can earn the stamp set which has cute pineapple that's always nice for welcome like if somebody has a new home and a lot of people seem to be moving so that could be perfect and then these great um it's just one stamp of leaves that are just amazing and this cute little plant so you can add it and make it to whatever you want it to be okay now this paper is daffodil afternoon i did get that paper let me get it out okay it's this wonderful daffodil paper but on the back if you remember let's see on this one for the cheese that's what i use they have great b side we call a side and b side but um yeah, think of using the more calmer um, prints for other types of cards. And, okay, I'll just show you that. Then we've also got these beautiful, I mean, they're already colored and done for you. All you have to do is add them to a card with a saying, and you've got a beautiful card. You have this nice window pane kind of a look on the back. Goes beautiful with that. I like how they coordinate them. Then you've got the two-sided paper that you can just cut. And this could be the bottom of your card. It's already done for you. And you can add the 3D um, tulips and things that they have in the catalog, which would add on top there if you wanna make it more dimensional. Beautiful striped on the back. There's some more beautiful leaves and paper. And these cute little hearts are on the back. And who said hearts have to be pink? These are great because they're green. Okay, we've got these beautiful daffodils. Beautiful paper to coordinate. And this could be used for anything. It could be any occasion. You've got more daffodils. Even flowers could be any occasion. This beautiful black with a little, little crosses, kind of a vanilla color. And then some little miniature ones. Okay, so that you can earn for free when you're purchasing $50. Don't forget to pick one out. All right, and there's a bunch of card ideas for you. Okay, then Catching Butterflies, I did get that one. Oh, and I didn't even show you, but this is the mischievous mice up close so you can see it. That's the guy I use, but I can't wait to use this for a birthday and put your, your birthday in there. And the little notes, I mean, just a quick note, everything that says note, I love for little notes. Um, all right, now we're on Catching Butterflies, which is a freebie and celebration with a $50 order. She's adorable. All oh, these cute little butterflies. You can either do a single or you can do a lot at one time like this. And you, uh, you make my heart happy. Celebrate every beautiful thing. Collecting sweet thoughts of you. And you know this would go perfect. Where are those? I've lost them. Okay. Um, 
These little brushed brass butterflies would go really cute in her net. I think they even did that. Well, they stamped one in here, but I would actually put some of these on there. That's adorable. Okay, then we've got driving by, cute. Who remembers the bug? If you're like my age, I'm sure you remember having a bug. You've got the um, VW bus. You've got some type of sports car. I'm not sure what that one is. And aw thanks, you've got style driving by just to say hi. And I've already seen somebody else who've made two cars looking at each other. I think it was the car, these two or these two. And they used the saying from the uh, robots that said, um, my heart goes beep for you. I mean, really cute. <laughs> so you can make them, you know, switch them in and out. Okay, here's your sunshine and rainbow paper. And that one is what I was showing you. I've already kind of gotten into this, so I'll show you the paper real quick. It's so bright and pretty. I did not show you this one. Let me see. Oh, here it is. I did this earlier on my blog. That if you go back, you'll see it. And I used the paper from this pack, and it's called Sunshine and Rainbows. But I just like that it had these, these polka dots, and then the stripes were on the back. So that's what I used, a strip of this for the inside of the card. I cut one of these from the contour dies, and then I cut this from the contour dies. I just shortened the card. And then I put one of our puffins that we had in the annual catalog, because I just think he's so cute, and he's got the little um, birthday hat. Now this saying, I wanted to tell you, was from the annual catalog, Sunny Sentiments, hoping your birthday is filled with all the best things. They have a thank you, a hello, sunny thoughts, but I use that birthday one, because I actually, just loved it and I made that for my birthday card so how cute is he <laughs> but let me show you some of the paper I'll put him over here so you've got your dots you've got your thicker stripes um, you've got this pretty I think it's a blue and then stripes you've got this which I'm pretty sure is midnight well, let's just see We've got Bermuda Bay, Flirty Flamingo, Green Apple Green, Magenta Madness, Mango Melody, Misty Moonlight, that's the color I was thinking, Petal Pink, Pool Party, and Soft Sea Foam, so Saffron. So you've got a lot of cool colors. And then it's got these cute pink, I don't know what those are, I guess just triangles. Really nice. Um, you've got, again, this pretty, this might be, I'm thinking, Soft sea foam. That's a pretty with the hearts. And then you've got these cool stripes on the back. You've got these, which almost look like mini rainbows. They could be clouds. And there's your clouds. These clouds coordinate with the punch. So the punch that you have in your mini catalog that is for clouds will punch these out. Okay, and you do get, I think, about four of each page, you know, of each paper. You've got some pretty green, pretty sure that's Granny Apple. And then on the back of that, you've got these great rainbows. Look at that sunshine card, oh, so gorgeous. And then these beautiful sun. So these rainbows are in the sun and everything, just to cheer somebody up. You've got this um, kind of loop-de-loop, -loop, I wanna call it, and then stripes. And let's see, what else do we have? More rainbows. And some more polka dots, and these are that soft sea foam green. Uh, let's see. We've got this Bermuda Bay, and some pretty pink on the back, and then larger rainbows that you can cut out, and I believe these match up with the dies, so you can check them with the dies in the mini um, catalog. Some more yellow, and then this beautiful, um, Again, rainbows, suns, clouds, and some more of the yellow on the back. So it's a great, a lot of paper, designer paper that you can earn for free. And that is with a $50 order. And it tells you right there if you want to know how much you have to spend to get it. Now, if you spend $100, you can look through here as long as it says 50 and pick out two items. Or you can pick out one. Now, here's some ideas for the boxes and the cards and things for the rainbows. This one is simply marvelous, so cute. That cute little um, 
awesome otter. I've already showed, well, I don't know if I did show you them. Here he is. Um, he's cute. He's got the little birthday hat too, so he'd make a great one instead of the puffins if you wanted. Um, he's got the fish. Here he's in the water. And here, if you get this marbleized paper, it just looks like the water and the ocean and things, and it just makes a beautiful card. So you can add that to the otter and have a nice card. But this one's 50 and that one's 50. So if you had 100, you could put these two and put the cards together. Okay, hello, friend stamp set. Now this is $100. It is um, 12 by 12 paper, all of this, plus this stamp set. So you're getting two things for the 100 and they won't break that up. That's $100 to earn that. And then on the back, let's see, this is also $100. It's this special moments. It's a stamp set, it has nothing but sayings, special moment sayings, and it's a beautiful set. Um, you can see some of the cards that they made here. Okay, and then, again, it says host, but if your order is $300, you can earn this set. This is a nice um, Common Camellia stamp set for free. So that is what they're offering for that. Again, if you join, you can see here it's $99 for $125 worth of products. And during celebration, you can get a choice. Now, celebration's only for two months. I just wanted to make sure you understand. This will go through June. So this is your whole spring, summer, um, up to Father's Day or whatever uh, catalog. This one only goes to February 28th. So if you want to join, you do it before February 28th because then you can pick out two free stamp sets in the catalogs, um, like I said, not celebration, but in the catalog, the annual catalog, clearance, anywhere you want. You just can't get the host set and you can't get um, celebration items. And so if you have any questions about that, just see me, but you can pick out any two that you want in addition to getting $125 worth of product for $99. I mean, you can't beat that. So I think that's, I've covered everything. I've told you all, um, all of my housekeeping things that I needed. Let me go over it real quick one more time. You get the two free stamp sets for joining my team now. Just go to Stamp Fanatics and hit Join the Fun. Um, the All Together is coming out for demonstrators, I believe it's tomorrow, and that's all the skin colored um, blend markers, designer paper, and two stamp sets. You can buy them separately, you can buy them all as a big bundle or a suite and um, they have dyes that match, I believe. And um, if you don't wanna wait, like for customers, it's February before you can order from this. But if you don't wanna wait, then go ahead and join up. And the last thing I had was they have a new kit. You have to go online, just go to where my shopping is and hit kits, and this is a new one. They're releasing them every so often. You remember at Christmas, we had a few kits that were, um, I don't have any cards. I think I sent them all out. But anyway, they had the Christmas cards and they had um, just different ones that have been so cute. So there's a new one that's gonna be coming out too. And that's all I have. Do you have any questions? Anybody have any questions? Okay, if you watch this later, you can still ask your questions. Just comment below and I'll read through them and I'll get back to you and tell you whatever I know um, to whatever your questions are. But I thank you for joining me today. Don't forget if you're ordering any of these great products today, because you can start um, to please use my host code and I will send you out a thank you. <clears throat> and now before we go, I promised I was gonna show you how I made this cute little treat box. Okay, so. I took one of the boxes, those sweet little talk boxes, and I just creased it all along the scored lines. I'm going to take the tear and tape off. Okay, and we're just gonna fold it in, fold the sides in, the little tabs, fold it up. Okay, coordinate here. Let me get some more light back now that we have the catalogs gone. There's two so shiny. And then we're just gonna pull it up. Let's do one side at a time. Okay, and just coordinate it and seal it. And then do the same thing on this side. Bring it up when you got it where you want it, then press down and seal. And then you can put your little corners in and you can close your box like this. Now, I'm gonna save you some money because 
I didn't really spend that much, but I did go and get conversation hearts because I'm gonna be using the conversation paper. And I thought, oh, well, that would be cute. Well, no, <laughs> this is slightly bigger than this, if you can see the width. So it doesn't fit in there. I've tried, it doesn't. So don't make the mistake I did unless you want to open these boxes and pour them in. You can always do that, but see, it's not going to, it's going to bulge the box, not really going to fit, and it's too long. So don't do that, what I did. <laughs> so I'll make a box for this later and show you. Um, what I did go get is just some of these little hearts. And I did not eat that one. Someone did packing them. But I went ahead and just put in a few of these. <clears throat> And you can fill it up as much or as little as you want. And then I closed it up. Okay? Simple, simple. When you have to make a classroom full for your grandkids or you've got to, you know, just make these up for a bunch of friends, which I'm going to give out to my friends, um, you don't want to have to hassle making a box. So here it is all made for you. Then I took um, two and a quarter by three and a quarter and I cut two of them. I'm going to use my liquid glue. Now, in the first box, I went all the way to the edge. I'm not doing that on this one. I actually went a quarter inch smaller. So this is the size that I'm telling you. And I'm just going to add that to the box front. I have time to wiggle it around and put it where I want it. There we go. And then press down. I'm going to do the same thing on the back. I'm actually doing the whole box. You can do as much as little as you want. If you want to just do the front and back, or if you just want to do, you know, the sides or not do the top and bottom, that's up to you. But I did all of it. I, okay. So then I have two pieces of one half inch by three and a quarter, and those are going to be the sides of my box. Let's go ahead and put that on. I just got my hand right in the glue. Or Okay, just kind of even it up. Rub this off my hands. Okay, then we'll do the second piece. Got the right side. And put it on this side. And the hearts go up and down, so I don't think it really matters which way you put it on. Okay, I just want to find the front of my box, which is right here. So then I want to put it on the top. So again, I've cut two pieces of one half inch by two and a quarter. And I'm going to put that on the top and the bottom of the box. Whoa. Slide that over. That's why I'm using the, the liquid glue because I can have time to move it around. And there. Oop, let that dry a minute. Okay. All right, then I have a piece of white paper, or basic white, or um, whisper white is fine. I have my two heart punches. These are in the annual catalog. They've been out for a while. So I'm going to use the scalloped one for my red. Just taking a piece of red, real red cardstock. And I'm going to punch that. And then I'm going to stamp. Hang on a minute. Where's my robot? I did take him out. Let me get him real quick. Hang on. I gotta find him with all these stamps. Totally forgot to take him out. Oops. Okay, here we go. No, I did take him out. Where did I put him? Oh, no way. Okay, things are disappearing here. I have too much stuff out. That's the problem. All right. Let me look again. Where is that stamp? He's probably where that other thing was I was looking for. Oh, you're kidding. No. Nope. Let's see. I've got the saying. Uh, <laughs> I don't see it. Oh my goodness. You know how things just disappear in your desk? Okay. Well, let's do this first. I'm going to tie my ribbon up. <clears throat> 
and I want to leave enough to make a bow. So get a little extra. I'm going to tie it at the top. Okay. And just tie it up as best you can. It's a little difficult when it's standing up narrow, but we've got it. And you can just turn it a little, tie it up tight. I think I've got it tight. Here we go. Okay. I wish I could have the stand, but I can't find it. You know how this goes when you're live, people. <laughs> this is like unbelievable. Okay. Um, hmm. I don't know where it went. It's not out anywhere. I'll find it the minute I turn this video off. But anyway, let's take one of the other guys. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see. Yep. Nope, this was the one I think I used. Let's see. I'm going to use a little bit of black memento ink. I'm going to ink them up. This is the guy. I'm missing, oh, I'm missing the saying. That's what I was missing, not the stamp. <laughs> Sometimes it's right in front of your face. Okay. So let's go ahead and stamp him. Uh, will that show? I don't think it will. Okay. And I'm going to take my real red ink. And over here, I'm just going to say the saying. Uh, let's see, go beep. I'm just going to do it. Let's do it this way. Okay. All right, let's get rid of all this. And I'm going to color him with three colors. I'm using light flirty flamingo. Uh, light Highland Heather and Dark Pop, not Dark Poppy, I'm using Dark Red. Oh, where is my Dark Red? Nothing. It's working here. Here we go. Dark Red. <laughs> okay. So, uh, you know, I could make him silver. I'm going to sit down for this part. But it's Valentine's Day. I love the colors in the paper. So I'm going to go ahead and just color him purple. So... This is the light, and I think I might have used dark, but I'm going to use the light just to see how it looks. And you know what? I'm going to take a piece of uh, paper. Where is it? Because I don't want to get the ink all over my desk. I'm going to use some of the um, grid paper because this does bleed through and I don't want to bleed through onto my desk. So here we go. All right, and let's go ahead and just, I didn't color his eyes, so I just kind of left that. Yeah, I think this is a little lighter, but I like it. And let's see, I colored his body. And he's just so cute. And this you can do sitting in front of the TV or just listening to some music and color a bunch of these up. And then to put them on the box, it's so fast. You saw what I did. It's all done for you. All you have to do is cut your paper ahead of time, glue it on, and you're about ready to go. Put your candy in and you're good. Or it doesn't have to be candy. It could be whatever you want it to be. Um, actually, I want to see. I think even a credit card. Let's see some credit cards right here would fit in there yep you could even do that you could do a little gift card credit card something like that and um it'll fit in the box for sure and you could still probably put a can in it okay i'm going to take my red and this is the darker of the real red i'm going to color my heart excuse my clock it's bombing that time of day. I forgot to do his little leggies. Hang on. There we go. And his neck. And then the flirty flamingo I'm doing for the little ears. I don't know if these are ears, but I think they are. And his mouth. <laughs> I'm making it a mouth. 
and up on the head and his little feet and his hands and we're done now i'm going to line up my heart stamp and i'm just going to put it in there oh some of it will show but that's okay let's see maybe not i think i pushed him over let me see how i did him him up a little bit. I think it was right about there. Yeah, it's not bad. Now, I do have these mono erasers, so if you happen to have a little smudge, you're good at erasing. Or you can put some of your gems on top if you want and just hide it that way. Um, I did get this mono eraser on Amazon, if you're wondering. And there was a little smudge over here. I could have just flipped the paper over and done the back and re-stamped it too, but I just want to show you. You can do it either way. Okay, let's get some of this on. And so the way I put it on my heart was off to the side like this. I didn't actually put it right there. I kind of smudged it over. You could put it in the middle if you want. Uh, oh no, I did do, that's what I did. All right, let's do it over. Hang on a minute, let me get a piece of paper. I use the scallop. I didn't even use the smaller one, but we could. I mean, you could use it. I liked the two scallops on top of each other. Um, well, let's just go ahead with that so I don't have to color them and do everything all over again. We can still either put it on straight, like that, or we can still do it off to the side. And for the size of the box, you could get away with it. So let's just still do it off to the side. It's something different. And then I'll just make my next one with the two. But I did do use, if you notice, the scallop on both. And that's why it went off to the side a little more. So let's just do that. I like it. From our mistakes in crafting, just new ideas. <laughs> so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put dimensionals but I'm gonna put them on either side because I don't wanna put it over the ribbon. So I'm gonna kind of go like that. I think that'll be enough, maybe one more. <clears throat> Let's just open those up. Take the backing off. This is what I'm doing, if you wanted to know. <laughs> okay, I'm doing it over my garbage can. And I'm gonna kind of put them right about there. Make sure it's kind of in the middle because I want to have room for my saying up here and room for my saying down there. Then I just took my scissors. Um, let me take my little snips, I think. And I said, you make. And I just cut it as big enough for the word. Let's see. I think I'm going to go a little bit shy of that. There we go. So you make will go up here and I'm gonna use my smaller dimensionals to lift those off. Just one there and one there. Okay. And we're gonna put it right here in the corner. You make, and then my heart go beep. So let's just cut this, cut it down more. I think that's pretty good. And this size, we can go back to the regular size dimensionals. And put two on there. Thanks for hanging with me so long. <laughs> I'm trying to make it worth your while here. Okay, my heart go beep. And we're gonna put that right down there. There you go. It's cute. Which ones do you like better? I kind of like the bigger um, scalloped edge here than this plain, but we're not done. We're gonna add some of our red rhinestones. Now I was out of red, so here's what I'm doing is I'm putting 
my regular rhinestones that I just colored with my dark red blend. And then I'm just going to go ahead and you want to kind of do that ahead of time maybe so that, that you could put it off to the side and let it dry. And then my little ones, I'm going to put one on that ear. And I got this idea from Angie Kennedy, Judah, <laughs> and I liked it. So I'm, go, I'm casing that part of her, her um, treat box. Okay, there we go. And then, let's see, do we need any more? Oh, I think we're good. I don't want to put it over that. I don't think you really notice it. But there's our two boxes. Comment below which one you like better. If you like the white trim around the paper or you like it end to end. And also if you like the scalloped or you like the plain. And I might have something to send out to you. So um, I'll see the answers and I'll pick and select someone to get a good little surprise of our new products. So thanks for joining me today. I appreciate it. Like I said, just shop with me at stampfanatics.com. Here's my host code. Let me get all this other stuff out of the way. And if you have not gotten a catalog, my customers get them for free. Um, when there's a new one coming out, just let me know and I'll be happy if I can send you one if you're not a demonstrator already. But um, thanks for joining me today. I appreciate it. And if you have any questions, comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what your favorites are. And then maybe I'll make some more products with those stamp sets and things and products. And that's all I've got. So thanks and have a great day.